What's up you guys, Marsha here. Just got in this uh, package from Nike.com. It's gonna be the Chris Paul Jordan 13. So let me get this out of the box for you guys. Show you guys a little uh, in-depth review of this bad boy. So here we go with the kicks. Jordan 13 silhouette here uh, in that PE colorway. So we're gonna have black leather on the tongue and then uh, sort of black here. Wish this was 3M piping, but it's not. A little disappointed in that. And then we got the Hornet blue suede or the Orion blue throughout the shoe here. And then the bottom, we're gonna have that uh, Hornet, like Hornet yellow on the bottom with the black accents and then that 23 Jumpman hologram in there. But the big thing that everyone uh, is looking at this shoe, the main difference is we got that, so that Jumpman, you know, we got that CP logo on there. So uh, yeah, shout out one time to Chris Paul, because believe it or not, I was born and raised on the Clippers. Used to go to back all their games back in the day when Elton Brand was the man. We had Darius Miles, Corey McGetty, Quentin Richardson, LO, Chris Wilcox, and all those other guys that no one cares about anymore. So it's sort of like, huge shout out to Chris Paul, because it feels like redemption as a fan for being all those years and loyal to a team that sucked and was the underdog, and now we're expected to win. But I mean, Chris Paul, he ain't balling like he was when he was wearing this shoe. He's a little older now, injuries, so we gotta get into that final soon. But overall, quality on the shoe, it's 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 okay, you know. A little disappointed with how everything is looking with the remaster. This to me feels like last year the only uh, 13 I copped the thing was the Dirty Breads, and similar similar quality to me on this with the sort of the materials, the suede and the leather. A little disappointed that you know the leather's not softer here, the suede's not like buttery. But um, can't really complain because you know I think this is the first shoe I ever caught on Nike.com, and like I can't even remember. I think the last time I was successful because I don't have a bot or anything. Last time I think I was successful was uh, I'm gonna have to say like the fire red fives, like in 2013 was the last thing I caught that I wanted off Nike.com. But uh, yeah, so I'm gonna end this video. A little on foot, hope you like that. And uh, until next time, peace.